I'm Arloa and welcome to Color Touch TV Commercial Edition. In today's episode, I'm going to show you the awesome security features in the commercial Color Touch. I'll show you how to set up the automatic screen lock so only users that know the security code can access the Color Touch. I'll also walk you through how to enforce temperature limits so no one can run the air conditioning too low or the heating too high. The last security feature I'll show you is how to give users access to features such as mode change or override without giving them access to other controls on the color touch. This will come in handy if you have an employee that is going to stay late, but you don't want to give them the access code. They can just hit the override button to let the color touch know they're staying a little late, and the color touch will keep the temperature at the occupied setting. This also works the other way around. If your employees leave early, they can press the override button to place the color touch into the unoccupied setting. Let me show you how to set this up. Let's start by creating the set point limits for the color touch. Press menu, then down arrow, and press the security icon. Next, press set point limits. Let's set the minimum cool set point limits. Press minimum cool set point. In this example, I'm going to set this to 69 degrees because I do not want anyone to be able to turn the air conditioning down past this point. Press back. Now let's set the max heat set point limit. I do not want anyone to run the heat beyond 72 degrees. Press back. These set points will allow the employees to have some control over the temperature, but not allow them to get out of control with it. To turn the set point limit on, be sure and press this button to enable it. Now, let me show you how to set up the pass lock feature so only employees that know the passcode can operate the color touch. Press menu, down arrow, then security icon, and then the auto screen lock button. Set passcode and input your desired passcode. In this example, I'll use one, two, three, four. Press enter and confirm by entering again. Press enter. Now turn on auto screen lock by pressing this button. Next, you will want to set the time to wait before the color touch locks. You can do this by pressing the lock after button. In this example, I will select two minutes. Press back. This screen also has options for turning on allow mode changes and allow override. Press the down arrow twice. Turning on mode change allows the user to turn the schedule on and off, while turning on override allows the user to override the schedule for a predetermined time. I think I want to allow my employees to use override, so I will turn this on. Press home and you're all set. Now, after two minutes, the color touch will lock. You'll know the security is on when you see the unlock button appear. As you can see, the override button is enabled. This will allow the employees to use this feature, but not allow them full access to the color touch. Press the unlock button and enter your passcode to regain full access to your color touch. As you can see, the Color Touch puts you in complete control of the levels of access available to other users. That's it for today. As always, if you have any questions, be sure and visit our website at thenstar.com. I'll see you next time on Color Touch TV Commercial Edition.